Alright, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make an authentic looking paintbrush in Photoshop. The first step was to go to File, New, Create a New Document, 400 by 400. Once that's done, you go to the Pen Tool right here, or this tool. Doesn't matter, you can get to it both ways and click on that. Then you go to your Shapes, and then you go All. Okay. Yeah, doesn't matter. No. I have all this because I was using uh, different shapes before. Now we got a paintbrush. No. There's a little paintbrush thingy. You just pick that. Now we're picking our color for our paintbrush. Gonna make it blackish. 505252. Five, five, two. That's the hex color code. Doesn't matter. <laughs> All right. Let's make it any size. I'm making it big for the purpose of this tutorial. All right. Now we have this. See, nice paintbrush. Now this looks stupid. It just looks like it's a shape from Photoshop, which it is. So we got to fix that. So now for the paint, uh, dripping paint part, we're gonna make a new layer. All right, hold on. Sorry, I'm an idiot. Right, whatever file. Layer, new, oh my god. Layer, doesn't matter, name it paint, I don't care what you name it, doesn't affect it. Alright, now we're gonna pick a new color. Seriously, it doesn't matter what color, so I'm not even gonna say the hex key. Just gonna pick any red. Blue, green, purple, orange, yellow, mellow. <laughs> you get the point. Now we're gonna want a hard brush. A soft brush looks stupid. Let's see if this is a good size. Alright, that's a good size. You're just gonna brush. Now you gotta make it smaller for the tip. So this is a 9, now we're going to make it a 4. Just going to brush like it's dripping, see? Doesn't need to be perfect. Alright, so now we got the dripping part. It doesn't look too good because I'm using a program that makes my um, thing blink, so I can't really do it too great right now. But whatever. So now we're going to create Control Shift N. I think that's what it was. Now this is going to be called Lines. Now basically, you're just going to grab a black tool. You're gonna, yeah, I wanna go up. All right, right here. Now you're gonna grab the little um, brush, small size, diameter of four. And this is simple. You're just gonna have to, okay, maybe a smaller diameter. Now you're going to do one right here in the indent, and one line right here. Now a few more steps. Now the last step actually. We're just going to write, let's say, 
let's pretend this is a uh, Crayola. No, that's too hard to spell. I don't know. Let's make up. This will be an artistic war brush. What's the company's name? There we go. Now all you're gonna do, pick any random font. I'm gonna pick Ariel for purposes because everyone has it. So is this 14? Maybe get smaller, it depends. I'm gonna write out hold on. Art. War. Now that's way too big. So I'm gonna lower that. Oh, nine. All right. Now all control. Hold it. Tilt it to the side. Perfect position. Let's see how it looks. Zoom out. Zoom out. And there you have it. A paintbrush says your brand name Artistic War. And you could always, like, write a clan name under it or something. I don't know. Be creative. Thanks for watching.